Good morning, Talmadge High School. Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Talmadge TV. We apologize for not broadcasting last week, but that was because of the holidays. But today we're back in action. So, without further ado, hey, I'm Philip Glass. Hey, hey, you guys. Hey, do you hear hey, that? Look at me. Yeah, where is that coming from? Hello? I think it's coming from over there. Hello. All right, hey. I'll just I'll take us over there. Over here. Oh. Hey, Cam. Don't you, oh, hey, Cameron, me. Don't, don't you remember when you guys, you know, totally trashed my segment? Like, you know, that really got to me, guys. That really got to me. Whoa, Cameron, just, just take it easy, dude. I rode on the back of an eagle. I exercised myself nearly to death. And, you know, I turned myself into a dead meme for you guys. And, and that wasn't enough. I mean, How Great is America was five seconds, and I think it was pretty important. Yeah, and your segment was kind of long, so... I'm just thinking that it only made sense to take the one that was shorter and keep it and then get rid of yours. We don't even really need the student sections anymore. I mean, it's just basketball season and most people just do blue and gold anyways. Hey, hey, hey chill hey, out, stop. chill out, hey. bro. Ah! Yep, that's what I thought. That'll teach them. Well, Philip and Derek are gonna be taking a break for a little while, completely voluntarily. Anyways, I'm Cameron Canuti, and this is Talmadge TV. <sighs> there we go. Now all we need is a second anchor. And luckily, I have an idea that might just be crazy enough to work. Ah, here it goes. How great is America? We've got Scott Seeker in the Talmadge TV studios. Scott, how great is America? It's pretty great. Oh, believe me, Scott, we get the point. But while you're here, would you like to anchor with me? Eskere! <laughs> All right, awesome. Well, let's go to Vaughn with the morning announcements. Similar to last week, there's another hat day coming up this Friday, December 8th. Pay $1 as you walk into school if you'd like to wear your favorite hat all day. And all proceeds of this hat day benefit various Christmas families. A congratulations goes out to our brand new wheelchair basketball team for competing in their first game ever last Wednesday. There are many more games to come, and we wish you the best of luck. And finally, Mediocre at Best will be having their second show entitled Coleslaw and Communism tomorrow at 7 p.m. in the Black Box. The cost is $3 and tickets are sold at the door. And this concludes your morning announcements. Thanks, Vaughn. Now let's go to... Wait, what comes after announcements again? It's, it's the sports update. Oh. Okay, sorry, man. I'm just really not used to being on camera for more than three seconds. You're good, dude. It, it just takes practice. Roger that. Now let's go for sports. In the scores that we were able to receive, last week's victories go out to our boys basketball team, along with the varsity boys, varsity girls, and junior varsity boys bowling teams. Way to represent, guys. Now... Onto the schedule. Coming up this week, the swim team has a meet this Friday at Alliance, and the wrestling team has two matches this week, one on Friday and the other on Saturday. The bowling team has a total of four matches this week, one on Wednesday, a second one on Friday, a third one on Saturday, and a final match on Sunday. And as for basketball, the boys have games on Tuesday and Friday, the girls team has games on Wednesday and Saturday, and the wheelchair team has a game this Wednesday. Thanks again, Vaughn. Now let's check out what the weather will be like for this week. Oh yeah, I forgot. Only Derek can do that. Hmm. Well, you know, when Vaughn and Phil were the anchors for the first episode, they both just kind of looked up and the weather just appeared. You want to try that? Sure, why not? Alrighty, let's do it. Three, two, one. Wow, <laughs> it actually worked. Thanks, Scott. You know, no problem, Cam. I'm just really surprised that I remember something that happened so long ago. Yeah, I guess some people just have an easier time remembering things. Speaking of which, let's see how well THS remembers what they were taught. We've got Spencer Murphy here in our student submitted segment, How Much Have You Learned? What's the largest U.S. state? Texas. Texas. Mexico. Wait, <laughs> wait, um, Texas. Either Texas or Alaska. 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 Okay, hear me out. Alaska. 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 Not including Romeo and Juliet, name one show written by William Shakespeare. Oh, The Taming of the Shrew. What? The Taming of the Shrew. Uh, Othello. Macbeth. Uh, uh Hamlet. God, Hamlet. Wait, um, Hamlet. Uh, show? Hamlet. Um, um, uh, Phantom of the Opera. What do we call the people on the Supreme Court? Uh, justices. Justices? The Supreme Court people. 
Justices. Justice Justices. Supreme Court Justices. Uh, John, help me out. Help me out, bro. Isn't it Justices? It is Justices, the first one to get it. What's special about the Winter Solstice? It's got, it's either got long, it's short days. Oh, it's the shortest day of the year? Shortest day of the year. Uh, it comes once a year. Once a year. That is true. It makes days shorter. Oh, I don't know. It has less days than the summer solstice? It's less days? Yeah. Winter less so hours. Less hours. How many teaspoons are in a tablespoon? Two. Oh, yeah, two. Two. Four. Somewhere, somewhere, somewhere in there. Four? Um, eight. Four. 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 Forty. Four. Not forty. Four. four. It's four. No, it's, <laughs> it's not four. 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 Eight. Three. No, it's three. Like five. Three. Three. Four. I thought it was three. Four. You got it. Four. Three. It's three. Name the first seven presidents. Oh, Washington, Adams, Jefferson, Madison, Monroe, Quincy Adams, Jackson. George Washington, <laughs> James Madison, Thomas Jefferson. That's all I know. Aaron Burr. I don't know. Oh, are those George no. Washington, Abraham Lincoln. No. <laughs> it's George Washington, John Adams, Thomas Jefferson, James Madison, James Monroe, Andrew Jackson. I'm pretty sure Andrew Abraham Jackson. Lincoln is in one of those. And J Jakey Way, Andrew Jackson. All right, so we got Washington. You got uh, Quincy Adams is one of them. Quincy. He's in there. He's, he's in there. He's definitely in there. Washington, Jefferson, Adams, Jefferson, Madison, Min Monroe, Quincy Adams, Jackson. Okay. Washington, Adams, Adams, Jefferson, Madison, Monroe, Adams, Jackson. George Washington, John Adams, uh, Quincy. No, I don't. I don't know. George Washington, um, John Adams. Yeah. Okay. Jefferson, Lincoln, Bush, Obama. Um, George Washington. George Washington. John Adams. John Adams. John Adams. Uh, Thomas, Jefferson, yeah, Jefferson. Thomas Jefferson. James Madison. Uh. Shoot. That's all I got. That's all I got, too. Uh, you were close. You were over halfway there. Adam Sandler was not a president. I'm sorry Jerry to say. Seinfeld. Neither was Jerry Seinfeld. What's the name of this segment that you're on right now? I don't know. There was no Talmadge TV last week. Huh? All right. Blame Vaughn. It's Vaughn's fault. <laughs> no. How oh, Great America. No, no, this is not How Great America. <laughs> the one that Spencer does. Questions with Spencer Murphy? Uh, can I get a hit? It's about learning stuff. It's about learning stuff? I still don't know. What, what did you, you learn at Talmud High School? We're, at a, that, we're on up. What did you learn at TA Cat? Close enough. This concludes another edition of How Much Have You Learned with Spencer Murphy. Thanks, Spencer. We appreciate you coming back on the show for that awesome segment. And don't forget, guys, you can come to us with any crazy or funny segment that you think of, and you might get the opportunity to come on the show. Oh, and by the way, don't forget to submit your student-submitted spotlight. Show us who's great at THS, even though you're all great. Just saying. <laughs> now, I'm Cameron Canuti. And I'm Scott Seeker. And this has been Talmadge TV. Be incredible, and we'll keep on being credible. Tune in for next week. <laughs> oh,